Amen. Now you understand why David said I was glad when they say to me, let us go into the house of the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. You feel refreshed. You feel like amen fighting on. You feel like you've been given a new lease of life. The bones may be weary. The body may be tired. Hallelujah. But let us go into the house of the Lord. Amen. Amen. Renew your strength like the eagles. Hallelujah. Amen. That's how I feel this morning. I believe you feel the same way. Amen. Let's give him a hand of praise. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Amen. I traveled by Elisha and my family. Amen. From Kampala this morning. So we're happy the Lord granted a safe journey. Amen. Amen. So shall we just take our Bibles, turn with me to three portions of Scripture. Hallelujah. We shall read from Luke chapter 22, verse 39 to uh, 46. <clears throat> Luke 22, 39, even to 46. We shall also read from Ephesians chapter 1, 1 to 11, and 1 Corinthians chapter 13. Amen. Uh, verse 4 to verse 7. So, before we read, let's just bow our heads for a word of prayer. Gracious Heavenly Father, your name is above all names. Amen. Your mercy endureth forever, your Bible says. Amen. And your grace abounds to all generations. Your love, Father, you showed upon Calvary's cross. It has no measure. It has no depth, no height. It has no breadth, Lord. Amen. It's forever amen abounding father amen and we are witnesses of your love lord we may not have been there two thousand years ago father but we have amen a witness today of all the great of all your mercy and your love that you've bestowed upon us father lord may you come down again lord and may you speak the word take me out of the way take the hearers out of the way father and may you minister lord in a special way Father, those that are sick and afflicted, we ask that, Lord, you may heal them, Father, even even as the word goes forth. And Lord Jesus, we ask the blessing and all the good things that come from thee. We ask them, Lord, that you send them down this morning. Speak to us again like you did, amen, with uh, Adam, Lord, and with uh, uh, Abraham, Father, in the cool of the evening. And Father, may you have fellowship one with thee, Father. We shall be careful to give you all the praise, to give you all the honor in Jesus Christ's name. We ask the blessing. Amen. 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 Luke chapter 22. Shall read from verse 39. Amen. Are you there? Amen. Church, say amen. 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 Verse 39 reads on this wise. And he came out and went as, as he was wont to the Mount of Olives. And his disciples also followed him. And when he, he was at the place, he said unto them, Pray that ye enter not into temptation. And he was withdrawn from them about a stone's cast, and kneeled down and prayed, Father, if thou will, if thou, if, if thou be willing, remove this cup from me. Nevertheless, not my will, but thine will be done. Amen. This was Jesus praying. He knew what was coming. Amen. Amen. And uh, he knew because the Bible says, I mean, uh, Brother Branham told us and taught us many times that Christ, amen, could see everything. He knew everything. And he was a prophet. So the Lord had shown him, amen, what was coming. St. John 5, 19. Amen. amen. He knew that in a couple of hours he would be betrayed. He would be killed. A gruesome death. And he was praying, Thou, Father, if thou will willing, remove this cup of suffering from me. Nevertheless, not my will. His will was that the cup of suffering would go. Amen. <clears throat> but nevertheless, he says, not, thy, not my will, but thine will be done. And there appeared an angel unto him from heaven, and strength, st uh, strengthening him. And being in an agony, he prayed more earnestly, and his sweat was as it were great drops of blood, falling down to the ground. And when he rose up from prayer, 
and was come to his disciples, he found them sleeping for sorrow. I always wonder what that means. <laughs> and he said unto them, Why sleep ye? Rise and pray, lest ye enter into temptation. Amen. The Bible also says, Man ought not to, to fear, but to pray. Let not, let not your heart fail, but pray. Amen. It's the greatest weapon that the Lord has given us. Amen. Shall we then turn to Ephesians chapter 1? Shall read from verse 1 to verse 11. It's a bit of a long reading, but bear with me. Amen. We are, we've come to church this morning. Amen. <clears throat> Paul, an apostle of Christ, by the will of God, to the saints which are at Ephesus, and to the faithful in Christ Jesus. You see, Paul here identifying himself as one, an apostle, and two, that it was by God's will. Amen. Amen. Uh, grace be to you and peace from our God, our, from, from God our Father, and from the Lord Jesus Christ. Blessed be the God of the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who hath blessed us with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in Christ. According as he hath chosen us in him before the foundation of the world, that we should be holy and without blame before him in love. Amen. So just notice three things there. If one, he chose us before the foundation of the world. And two, that we should be holy and without blame. And again, before him in love. Having predestinated us unto the adoption of children by Jesus Christ to himself, according to the good pleasure of his will, to the praise of the glory of his grace, wherein he hath made us accepted in the beloved, in whom we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins according to the riches of his grace, wherein he hath abounded toward us all in all wisdom and prudence, having made known unto us the mystery of his will, according to his good pleasure, which he hath purposed in himself, that in the dispensation of the fullness of times, he might gather together in one all things in Christ, both which are in heaven and which are on the earth, even in him. In whom also we have obtained an inheritance, being predestinated according to the purpose of him who worketh all things after the counsel of his own will. Amen. 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 He doesn't have to consult with anybody. Amen. He'll consult with his will. Amen. Amen. And First Corinthians chapter 1, uh, chapter 13. First Corinthians chapter 13 from verse uh, 4 to verse 7. <clears throat> charity suffereth long. Amen. We know charity is love. The Bible says charity, it suffereth long. And it is kind. Charity envieth not. Charity vaunteth not itself. Is not puffed up. Doth not behave itself unseemingly. Unseemly. Seeketh not her own. Is not easily provoked. Thinketh no evil. Rejoiceth not in iniquity, but rejoiceth in the truth. Beareth all things, believeth all things, hopeth all things, endureth all things. Charity never faileth, but whether there be prophecies, they shall fail. Whether there be tongues, they shall cease. Whether there be knowledge, it shall vanish away. For we know in part, and we prophesy in part. But when that which is perfect is come, then that which is in part shall be done away with. Amen. May the Lord add a blessing to the reading of his word. Amen. You may be seated. Amen. Amen. Church, say amen. amen. And you pray for me. It's not a long message. It's a short message, but you pray for me. Amen. The title of my message this morning is the mystery of his will. Amen. Amen. The mystery of his will. Amen. He said it's a mystery. Amen. But the Bible says he has revealed it already unto us. Amen. And my inspiration, not my will, but thine be done. 
Amen. And as you read in the scripture, Christ in Gethsemane, when he was praying, he was in agony, praying, Lord, let thy will, let if it be possible, take this cup of suffering. Amen. Take this cup of affliction. Lord, take it away from me. Amen. Amen. But nevertheless, not my will, but thine will be done. Amen. Amen. And it's good to be found in his will. Amen. Because in his will is his purpose. In his will is where you find predestination. In his will is where you find your, amen, purpose for being on this earth. In his will you find healing. In his will you'll find your adoption. Hallelujah. In his will you are predestinated to be sons and daughters of God. Hallelujah. Outside of his will there's death. Hallelujah. You may not see it. Hallelujah. But there's death outside his will. So Lord, not my will, but thine will be done. We will pray his prayer. Hallelujah. You know you have to suffer some affliction. You have to suffer some pain. Maybe fall sick. Hallelujah. But nevertheless, not my will, but thine will be done. Is that your prayer this morning? Hallelujah. And his will is sovereign. Hallelujah. His will is sovereign. He does not, amen, is above all else. Amen. amen. For without his will, we could not be formed. Amen. amen. There would be no life. Amen. There would be no grace. Amen. There would be nothing. Amen. There would be no beginning. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. There would be no Christ upon the earth. Amen. Hallelujah. Upon the cross to die. Amen. There would be nothing without his will. Amen. His will is sovereign. Amen. It must come to pass. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. amen. His will brought Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. And he stayed 30 some years upon the earth. Amen. His will brought healing Amen. in his wings. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. His will. Amen. Amen. Has predestinated us and blessed us here today. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. That we may be conformed. Amen. Hallelujah. To be sons and daughters of God. Amen. That's his will. Amen. And we are happy this morning. Amen. We are happy that we have conformed into his will. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Let me read a quote here. Amen. From Brother Branham. How the seed falls into the ground and it rots. Amen. Amen. And to bring forth life again. Amen. Amen. Looks like if, we, if it ever, if, if uh, it was ever going to bring forth life, it would be when it's in its perfect shape. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. That's, the, that's when you would think it would bring forth life. Amen. If life was ever in it, then why wouldn't it just come forth the way it is? Amen. Put it in the ground. The life spring forth. Why does all that's around that life, all that's around the germ that no man can find, how is it that everything material around that germ has to die? Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. So it can spring forth, amen, in a new life. But everything around it must also die rot amen before it can spring forth life hallelujah so is it with an individual as long as there is any human interjections injections human ideas then god's jam then god's jam of life the holy spirit can't work hallelujah you've got to die amen amen and now then we find out that we come to another ephesians Amen. Another Ephesus. Yeah. Paul said, I a prisoner, I'm an apostle of Christ. Yeah. Amen. I represent. Amen. Yeah. Hallelujah. That Ephesians. Yeah. Amen. Amen. We find out that there must come another Ephesians. Yeah. Another Ephesus now. Amen. We are at that intellectual, where that in our intellectual denominations and so forth, and all our educational programs has come to its Jordan. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen has come to its Jordan. It has come to die. Hallelujah. To leave everything in the wilderness. To leave Egypt behind us. Amen. Then we must have an Ephesians again. Hallelujah. This is the hour of divine consecration. Amen. If you can believe, the Lord God requires a consecration. He cannot break forth upon us until we have been so surrendered. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. To what? To his will. 
Amen. Amen. To his power. Amen. He cannot break forth until we have our hearts so cleansed from sin and things of this world. Yeah. Until the Holy Ghost can ride upon us yeah. and so surround, up, surround us yeah. now as he has right now with me. Yeah. Amen. That's Brother Branham. Speak to this mountain. Amen. Hallelujah. If we can surrender. Amen. And so surrender. Yeah. And be so consecrated. Yeah. And that the Holy Ghost can ride upon us. Yeah. And so surround us now. Yeah. As he has with me right now. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Speak to this mountain. Yeah. That was Brother Branham speaking in that message. Yeah. If you can surrender, yeah. then you can speak to the mountain. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. If you can consecrate yourself, then the Lord can move. Yeah. The Holy Ghost can move. Yeah. Then you come to your Jordan yeah. and leave the wilderness. Yeah. Leave Egypt. Yeah. Leave the free manor. Yeah. Come and fight for your inheritance. Yeah. Hallelujah. Let the Holy Ghost, amen, take over the meeting. Let him take over this service. Let him carry it into consecration. Each one of you dig down in your heart and take out all the root of bitterness. Take out all the sin, all the unbelief, all the skepticism that you have had in your heart. Throw it out. Get ready. The Holy Ghost is going to do great things in the midst of you. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh Lord, I consecrate myself. Put me in this new ministry, Lord. Amen. That your power and your strength and your mercy will anoint me with the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Is that the way you feel? That the Lord may bless you into that ministry. Into that new ministry. Hallelujah. You are part of that Ephesians ministry. Amen. You may not be an apostle. You may not be a, 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 an evangelist. You may not be a pastor. You may not be a preacher. Hallelujah. But you are part of that pride. You are part of that ministry. Blessed be the name of the Lord. You are part of that ministry. You are part of his divine will. Hallelujah. You're going to be conformed into his divine nature. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Blessed be his holy name. And he said we'll be conformed into his will. There's nothing greater. Nothing greater than to be found into the will of God. Hallelujah. That's where he's ordered us, ordered, ordered us into. Amen. May he take control. Amen. Like he did brother Branham. Amen. Say amen. Blessed be his holy name. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 This is coming into that third pool. I am believing it. Brother Branham says. This is just the starting. This is just starting to bloom now. Amen. And you're speaking about that third pool. Amen. As he walked into it. He says it's starting to bloom now. And the Lord allowed him five manifestations amen. of that spoken word. Yes, and he said, Amen. Maybe it should not go. Oh, if it had gone on and on, it would have gone into, Amen, the rapture. Yes, amen. amen. But he said, This is just an example of what is to come. Yes, Hallelujah. He said, The Holy Ghost will come back yes, and will ride that trail one more time. Yes, but right now, it is starting to bloom. Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, it is just starting to bloom now. Yes, I am working out something. It is taking the amen. It's taking this charge of faith and going right back to, to begin and to come in. See, to kind of raise faith in a bracket to where you never noticed it. Amen. That way before. Amen. Not a faith, but a perfect faith amen. built up in here. Yeah. Amen. And watch a perfect God with a perfect heart, amen. keep a perfect promise amen. by his perfect word, amen. which is sharper amen. than a two-edged sword amen. and a discern of the thoughts and the hearts. And what? We are coming now, amen, amen to that perfection. Amen. amen, because the people has come to this in order of the rapture. Amen. That's what's holding it right now. Amen, is waiting for that church amen. to come into perfect rapturing faith i am looking for it and we are looking for it it means a lot of shaking down for me it means
Praise the Lord or shake him down for you. But together we will make it by the grace of God. Say amen. Hallelujah. We will make it by the grace of God. Oh brother, it needs a lot of shaking down. Shaking down for brother Branham. It shook him down. He told him he must be more sincere for the third pool. It means a lot of shaking down. Amen. For you, the church and the bride. But we together, hallelujah, we will make it by the grace of God. Hallelujah. Sovereign grace will take over. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Divine love is projecting. Amen. We read that scripture without love. It's impossible. Impossible. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. For, you, for you are nothing. You are nothing without love. Amen. Without charity. Yes. Amen. But by his grace, we will make it. Amen. We will make it someday. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Say amen to Roro. Yes. Say amen Nairobi. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Amen. amen. And all the world is groaning. And it's waiting for the manifestations of the sons of God. Amen. Amen. Waiting for the church to get back to its place again. Amen. Sons of God be to be made manifest. Amen. Waiting for that hour. Amen. Are we at that hour? Amen. 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 Are you at that hour? Amen. Where you can see the will of the Father. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Are you at that hour? Where you can get down on your knees. And you can reveal his divine purpose. Amen. You, and you cry out to him, not my will, Lord. Not my will, Lord, but thine will, Father. Let that will be done. Hallelujah. Amen. For the world is groaning. Amen. You can see the world. Amen. Adverse weather. Hallelujah. The world is turning upside down. Wars, rumors of wars. Hallelujah. Amen. But the world is waiting for the manifestations of the sons and daughters of God. Amen. We are that hour. Hope that you don't hurt. Hope that don't hurt. But I just had to say it. See, the church is so far away from its place. It needs to be back to sons of God again. Rulers, governors of the earth. Under the spiritual reign. Hallelujah. It will, it will be someday. Amen. When the chief one comes, Jesus Christ, the great millennium, nature's groaning for that day. Hallelujah. Amen. And are we here, my brothers? Hallelujah. You see tsunamis. Amen. Floods and all kinds of things. Things we've never seen before. Amen. What is that nature groaning? We see, amen, so much heat. Amen. Heat waves. Hallelujah. What is it? Nature is groaning. Hallelujah. For the sons and daughters of God. And brother, you must know your place. You must take a hold of your place. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. The church must get back to its place. Amen. Amen. Like Jesus told the apostles. Amen. He told his, his uh, disciples. Amen. Why do not sleep? Amen. Rise and pray. Amen. Unless you, be, uh, you enter into temptation. Amen. Amen. For God, Jesus could see what was coming. Amen. Amen. It was a hard time coming. Amen. Amen. And he was preparing his disciples. Amen. 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 If ye abide in me. And my words in you, you shall you can ask what you will, amen. amen because you are asking his word, amen. you are asking his word, amen. hallelujah, amen. amen, amen. And his word is life, speak it, amen. hallelujah. If God said it, and you are sure he said it, the Holy Ghost bears record and witness amen. that the word is right, amen. then there you are, brother, speak it. There it is. Say to this mountain, be moved. Don't doubt it in your heart. But believe that what you have said will come to pass. Hallelujah. It's not you that speaketh. But my father that dwelleth in you. He doeth the talking. It's not you that's talking. Amen to that mountain. It's the father that's in you. Speak to that mountain. It has got to move. Amen. What is that? Amen. It is the word that you're speaking. It's not your words. Amen, amen, amen. Say amen, church. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. For the will of the Father is before us this morning. Amen. Amen. Let's just examine that a little bit further. 
Amen. The mystery of his will, as he said in Ephesians. Amen. amen. Say amen, brothers. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Say, blessed be the, the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who hath blessed us with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places. Now, Paul is not speaking of the natural blessing. Hallelujah. Amen. The natural blessing, blessing will come. It will always be there. Amen. He's speaking about the spiritual blessing. Amen. Amen. Which he, the Lord has given to us. Amen. Amen. In Christ Jesus. Amen. Amen. According to he has chosen us in him before the foundation of the world. Amen. amen. You see, amen. Uh, unfortunately for the devil, this game or if it was ever won, amen, this particular thing is already settled yeah. for the foundation of the world. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. You think it's unfair? No, it's not unfair. Amen. He predestinated us before the foundation of the world. Yeah. Settled in heaven. Yeah. Hallelujah. <clears throat> that, we should, that we should be holy and without him, without blame, before him in love. And you read the scripture where it said, Amen, without love, without that charity, we are nothing. Amen. And it says, we shall be blameless before him in love. You cannot approach the Lord. Amen. Outside of love. Impossible. The will of the Father, like I said, is sovereign. Amen. But you cannot approach his will. Amen. Outside of love. Amen. He said, consecrate yourselves. Amen. It's, it's a requirement. If you can only, had Brother Branham, if you can only consecrate yourselves. Amen. Come before him in the third pool, sincere. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. And come before him in love. Amen. You can find his will. Amen. Then you can find his purpose. Amen. Amen. And it's the, Father's good, it's the Father's will. It's his good pleasure to give you all that is his. Amen. 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 And we are called to be part of his will. Because the Bible says we are predestinated to be conformed to his will. One, predestinated us unto adoption. We are already children. We are already children. You don't have to, be, to ask to be one. He has predestinated you already. Amen. Unto adoption. Amen. And two, amen. He, that this he did according to his good pleasure. Amen. He already, he already had a, a plan formulated in his mind. Amen. Amen. And he did this according to his good pleasure. Amen. And three, he has made us, he had made, has made known unto us the mystery of his will. Amen. His will is a mystery. Amen. It's a mystery to the, amen, to, to, to everybody but not to you. Amen. Because the Bible says he has made known, amen, amen his mystery according to his good pleasure. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. But at the end of time, that in the last dispensation, that in the, full, in the fullness of time, amen, when time is complete, all things will be gathered together in Christ Jesus. Amen. Those that are in heaven and those that are on earth will be gathered together, amen, in Christ Jesus. And he made known and plain to un unto us. Amen. We shall be rewarded with an inheritance, amen, as he has predestinated according to his purpose, after the counsel of his own will. Yeah. Like I said, he doesn't have to consult with anybody. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. He doesn't have to come to consult with you. No. Can I show you my pleasure? Can I show you my will? Can I heal you? Amen. He has already predestinated it. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. Has already rewarded us. Yeah. He has already rewarded us yeah. with an inheritance. Yeah. Amen. That he predestinated yeah. according to the purpose after the counsel of his own will. Amen. Say amen. amen. Hallelujah. Amen. amen. Wherein he has abounded toward us. Amen. 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 Wherein he has abounded toward us. In all wisdom and prudence. Amen. Having made known unto us the mystery of his will. Amen. According to the good pleasure. Which he had purposed in himself. Amen. amen. Hallelujah. Amen. amen. And you can imagine. If we knew what God's will for us tomorrow would be, how we could feel right now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
Amen. Amen. We may not know, but he, we know that the plans that he has for us are good plans. Yeah. They are good plans. Yeah. Hallelujah. They are not wicked plans. No. They are good plans. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. So, Father, let thy will be done. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. Say amen. amen. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. That we should be to the praise of his glory who first trusted in Christ, Amen. in whom he also trusted, after ye heard the word of truth. Amen. 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 And the gospel of salvation, in whom also, after that ye believed, you were sealed with the Holy, Go Holy Spirit of promise. Amen. Say Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. So the mystery of his will, Amen, is that we should be conformed to be sons and daughters of God. Yeah. Hallelujah. The heaviest lifting Christ has already done. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. So Father, reveal to us the, your mystery. Yeah. The mystery of your will. Yeah. Reveal unto us this day, Lord. Yeah. Amen. That we may be conformed to be children. Yeah. To walk upright. Yeah. To talk like children. Yeah. To, amen. Talk like sons and daughters of God. Yeah. Amen. To heal the sick. Yeah. To raise the dead. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. To be made manifest. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Say amen. Yeah. Let me just take it. Water. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. So there always comes that time like it was at Gethsemane. Gethsemane. When, hallelujah, the, the season and time changes. Amen. Amen. When the season changes. When the ministry changes. Amen. When you enter into your third pool or your third, or your, uh, third phase. Amen. Amen. And Brother Branham said the third pool is for the bride. Amen. He was healing five manifestations. Amen. Amen. Of spoken word. Amen. Amen. Spoken word healing. Spoken word uh, creation. Amen. And he said that's what we are coming to. Amen. Amen. That is his will. Hallelujah. Amen. It may not seem, it may seem like something small, but that is his will to have full power. For you to have full power. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. He, 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 he promised that he will pour upon uh, his spirit upon all flesh without measure. Hallelujah. Without measure. Hallelujah. Amen. Brother Brother may have had five manifestations, but you will have no without measure. Hallelujah. You walk into the hospitals, the sick will be will rise up. Hallelujah. The dead will rise up. Hallelujah. Amen. You will speak to the dead that are dead in Christ. You will open up those graves. Hallelujah. What is that? His will. It is coming to pass. Hallelujah. May not be today. Maybe tomorrow, the day after. I don't know. But you are in his will. Hallelujah. Amen, amen, amen. First Thessalonians chapter 16. Hallelujah. The shout. Amen. The trump. Hallelujah. Amen. And the voice of God. Hallelujah. Is that what you desire? Amen. Three parts to it. Two have already gone by. Amen. But there's coming another. Amen. The voice of that resurrection. To call the sleeping saints. Amen. You are to fulfill that. Hallelujah. Greater things. Amen. You Brother Branham said, you think you have seen great things. Wait till that time comes. Amen. Much greater. Greater things shall you see. And it will be fulfilled in the bride. It will be in his will. In his purpose. Hallelujah. To be conformed into his will. And the time is now. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Say amen. Hallelujah. Give the Lord a hand of praise. Amen. Amen, amen, amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Blessed be his holy name. Let's give the Lord a hand of praise one more time. Amen. 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 And they you may be seated. And they have to have a crucifixion. Amen. Before you can have a resurrection. Amen. Say amen. You have to have a crucifixion. Before you can have a resurrection. Amen. And resurrection is a new life. 
Amen. And before the church will ever be able to see a resurrection, resurrected power, Amen. before I can ever see a new ministry take place, Amen. there has got to be a self-crucifixion. Amen. Amen. So that there can come a resurrection. Amen. We have got to die out yes. to our own thoughts. Amen. Die out to our own ways. Yes. Die out to everything that's around us. Amen. Go through the trials and tribulations. Amen. Go through your own Gethsemane. Amen. Amen. We have got to die out that we might see a new resurrection and a new life. Hallelujah. Amen. So we, if we ourselves, then in our own ministry, and in, if in our own thoughts, and in our own life, we abide as we are, we can do no good. Praise God. Amen. We have got to die. We have got, amen, for Christ to accomplish his ministry. He had to die. Hallelujah. Except the Son of Man, amen, a corn of wheat, amen, put in the ground and die. Yeah. It abideth alone. Yeah. Amen. You could not see the resurrection power. Yeah. Amen. If he did not die, you could not see all these things. If Christ didn't die, except the corn of wheat, amen, die, it abideth alone. Yeah. Amen. We have got also to die at the altar. Yeah. Amen. Or we live alone. We are, we, amen, we'll live to some denomination or some creed. We'll live alone. We'll live to some organization. But if we die to ourselves, then the Holy Spirit, amen, will be spread forth everywhere. By our lips, we have got to die. Say amen. Amen, we must realize, amen, that we have got to die in order to bring forth new life. Not your life. Amen, for your life is, is, is terrible. Hallelujah. Amen. It's full of backbiting and all these kind of things. It's a sinful life. We have got to die to our own life to bring forth his life. So, he, amen. So he said so much in this. If you want to see me, you must die to yourself. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. And then you will bring forth a new life, which is my life. Amen. That will say we would see Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen, amen, amen. Say amen. Amen, amen. Amen, amen, amen. Amen. So we have got to die a, corn of, a death of a corn of wheat. Amen. To bring forth that life. Amen. So you see, amen, how Christ upon Gethsemane. Amen. He cried. He said, the Bible says his, his uh, sweat was like as it were drops of great drops of blood. Amen. The pain that was coming upon him. Amen, but he knew he had to die. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. For a new life to bring forth, to come forth. Amen. He, he had everything within him. Mm. Bible says all that was in the Father, he poured into Christ. Amen. Amen. But for him to pour everything that was in Christ into the church, he first had to go through the cross. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Amen. For you to see yes. a new life, yes. for you to witness yes. that life, yes. for you to witness, yes. amen, full power. Yes. Hallelujah for you to see St. John 5 19. You have got to go upon your cross and you have got to die. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 For I know the plans I have for you, saith the Lord. They are good plans, His will. Say amen. May you give Him a hand of praise. Amen. 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 And now, not knowing. Of course, being spiritual, amen, you which, uh, you watch spiritual things, not knowing this, God knows it, but if you will turn and look at the clock, it's on the dot, two o'clock, amen, the end of the second pool, the third pool is at hand, amen, amen. second pool has been manifested, is done, amen. amen, did you notice, the spirit take the same song and picking it up an octave higher, like that, the next thing, the third, the next Next pool is at hand. Amen. Amen. That was Christ in the midst of God revealed. So we know that the times are changing. Amen. Amen. We can feel it. Amen. Anyone that is spiritual knows the times are changing. Amen. We can feel it. Amen. Amen. Nuclear war is almost upon us. Amen. Amen. We're wondering when is it going to be? Amen. Amen. Russia is cleaning its nuclear warheads. Amen. Amen. Brother Branham said there's a nuclear warhead with America's name upon it. <laughs> Hallelujah. It's wiping them clean. Amen. Preparing for that final war to blast. Amen. A nuclear war is upon us. Amen. But what, what about the bride? Amen. When you see those things happening in the natural, prepare for the spiritual. 
Amen. The rapture is upon us. Amen. But we have got to come to a, to a place where we have died out. We must die out. We have no option. We must go to Calvary. Our own Calvary. Killing this body. Amen. The things that it desires. We have got to come to that place. Amen. To see his purpose and his will. Amen. May we give the Lord a hand of praise. Amen. Amen. So, amen, Brother Branham. And we are expecting, I have a great expectation this morning. Amen. And the most, en uh, and most any meeting I have ever been yet. Because I believe that we are just at the eve of something fixing to happen. I have looked forward to it for a long time. Have you looked forward to it for a long time? Yeah. Amen. Hallelujah. And I believe that we are right at, on the verge of it now. For something that God is going to help his children a little f further up the road. Yeah. Amen. You know the Bible said, when the enemy comes in like a flood, the spirit of God will raise up a standard against it. Yeah. And when God gives his church a blessing, and they move along in that blessing so long until it comes becomes common to the world then they begin to run it down then the spirit of god comes in and raises a stand up standard again and there is a breaking forth of a revival or something amen amen i truly am expecting a great change in my ministry right away until that comes it's happened once until it comes, I'll remain with my regular ministry. But oh, if it will just take place this week, there will be a shaking through this country. I promise you. Amen. That you, you have never dreamed of. And the great ransom church of God will take a move forward. Amen. Is that the way we feel? That there's going to be a breaking forth. Amen. There's going to be a change. A change is coming. Amen. A change is here. Let me say. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. We expect that change to take the bride. Amen. From how, what you feel right now. It has become common to man. Amen. That we will say St. John 5, 19 and sounds common. But believe me, you brothers. Believe me, you sisters. Amen. The change is here. Whether you believe it or you don't believe it. Hallelujah. The church, the church is stepping forth into its full power. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. For we have been conformed into his will. We have been found into in his purpose. We have been found worthy. Hallelujah. Amen. And that change is, is coming. That change is going to happen. Whether we like it or whether we don't like it. Amen. The Lord is going to sweep this church. Amen. One more time. There's going to be a ride one more time. Hallelujah. He's going to sweep forth and raise this church into such power that has never been seen before. Hallelujah. Before, Because we have been found in his will. Not my will, Father, but thine will be done. Hallelujah. Amen. We are nothing without his love. Charity. Though we have all things. Amen. We do all things. Whether we speak in tongues and have all things and have not his love, we are dead. We are nothing. Amen. We are to appear before him blameless in, and in love. You, can't you cannot present yourself before him blameless if you have not charity. Why? It's the essence of God. God cannot marry anything other than his, amen, his nature. Hallelujah. So he says, come before me. Come before me. Amen. Blameless but in love. If you have not charity. If you have not my nature. Amen. I cannot give you my will. I cannot show you the mystery of my will. So come before me. In my nature. Die out. Die to yourself. Let my nature come in. Let my love come in. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's what his desire is. Let my love come in. Let me take a control of your life. Hallelujah. Amen. Are we going to die out today? And may his love come in. Is that the way you believe? Is that the way you desire? To consecrate yourself for that third pool. For the change of a ministry. Is that the way you, is that what you want? Amen. Then you come before the Lord. Crying before him. Lord take a hold of me. Say amen church. 
Amen, amen, amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Amen, amen. Hallelujah. Oh, let's give the Lord a hand of praise. Amen. 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 Amen, amen. I'm, amen, I'm coming to the end. I told you it won't be long. It will be a short message. Amen. But one thing I pray and desire is that we can be found in his will. Amen. 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 If you look at Joshua, amen, Joshua was a type of Ephesians. Amen. He walked by the will of God. Amen. amen. One evening he was walking, thinking about how he would take control or bring down those Jericho walls. Amen. amen. Strolling around, a great warrior, Joshua. Amen. And there appeared somebody before him, a great man, a man of, of war with a sword in his hand. And Joshua drew his sword too. Amen. Asked him a question. Amen. Are you for us? Or you are you against us or for our enemies? Amen. Said, Nay, I'm the captain of the host. Amen. And Joshua fell down Amen. and said, What would you have thy servant do? Amen. His mind was bringing down Jericho's walls. Amen. That's what our mind should be like Amen. bringing down all the Jericho walls around our lives. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We have to take a hold. Amen. Of our promises. Amen. We have to take a hold Amen. of each and every promise. Amen. Hallelujah. Joshua was seeking God's will. Amen. He was planning, thinking, what can I do to be in the will of the Father? Yeah. And when the angel appeared before him, yeah. amen, he knew that the will of God had come. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. What would you have thy servant do? Yeah. He didn't ask, what can I do? Yeah. I'm planning to do this and I'm planning to do that. Yeah. Hallelujah. This is my plan, Lord. You yeah. know, he said, what will you have thy servant do? Yeah. Can I be in your will, Father? Can I be found in your will? Yeah. What would you have me do? Yeah. Hallelujah. That's the way we should be every time. Yeah. Hallelujah. Not about what your mind thinks. What your desire is. Yeah. What would you have your servant do? Yeah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Yeah. Not my will, but thy will be done. Yeah. When they were praying. Yeah. Amen. Paul and Silas had been locked up. Hallelujah. And they were praying in the upper, I mean, uh, in a room praying for Paul and Silas. Hallelujah. And there was a shaking. Amen. In the prison. Amen. The prison gates came down. Hallelujah. Amen. And as they prayed, they were being persecuted. Amen. Uh, Peter, that was, sorry, that was Peter. They were being persecuted in Israel. They could not even move among the people. And they sat and they came together and they prayed and prayed and prayed yeah. to be in the will of the Father. Yeah. And there was a great shake in, Jer in Jerusalem. Yeah. The Bible said no one came to, amen, added themselves to them except the Lord gave, amen, the increase. Yeah. Hallelujah. What was happening? They were, amen, people feared them yeah. because they were killing, the, 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 uh, they were persecuting the, uh, the apostles, yeah. those that had witnessed Christ in uh, the upper room. Yeah tearing down their testimony but when they prayed the Lord strengthened them he gave them his will and they set out in Jerusalem with great confidence hallelujah why they were found in his will hallelujah Paul and Silas found in his will as they walked upon Jerusalem they were healing their shadows were healing the sick hallelujah they charged them not to speak these things hallelujah but what did he do what did they did it anyhow why they were found in his will yeah. so it pays to be in the will of the father yeah. hallelujah yeah. every time brother branham like we read here he said ah, as it is as i am in the control of god amen let me read that again here amen amen uh, let me just get it here say amen yeah. amen amen yeah. hallelujah hallelujah Amen. 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 As you see, Brother Branham said, as Amen, he was uh, ministering and said, let the Holy Spirit take a control of you as it is with me. Amen. Amen. If the Lord takes a control of you, then the Holy Ghost can walk in a mighty way. He can raise the dead. He can heal the sick. Amen. Then we can have the third pool manifest among us. Amen. But first, let the Holy Ghost take a control of you. Let him have his way with you. Amen. And when you come to that place where you see nothing but the will of the Father, 
Amen. Nothing is impossible. Amen. The supernatural can be made manifest in this church in Nairobi. Amen. Hallelujah. Nothing is impossible. Nothing is impossible. Amen. With our God. Amen. Say amen, church. Hallelujah. Amen. If only you can be more sincere. Amen. There's one thing you must do. You must be more sincere. Amen. See, you must be more sincere. Amen. Say, Lord, well, God, give, forgive me for my insincerity. Amen. And let me be more sincere. Amen. And let me have more sincerity. Amen. And when I raised up my hands to him again, Amen. there was a great something came over me. Amen. Just lifted me up. Seemed like, amen, my whole body was changed. Amen. Was charged with something. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. amen. That was Brother Branham testifying. His whole body was charged with something. What was it? He had yielded himself to the will of the Father. Amen. Make me more sincere, Father. Consecrate myself unto thee, Father. Amen. But make me more sincere for this third pool. Hallelujah. Amen. And you're going to be blessed. He's going to use you. Hallelujah. He does not want to use anything out there. He doesn't want to use the trees. The cows and the oxen. He wants to use you. That's why he predestinated you to be found in his will. His good pleasure. Hallelujah. Amen, amen, amen. Amen, amen, amen. Hallelujah. And do not worry. Don't look at your failings. Don't look at your shortcomings. He has chosen you from before the foundation of the world. It is you he loves. Hallelujah. It is you he has revealed his mystery. It is you he is going to make manifest. Hallelujah. It is you that he has told you be adopted sons and daughters. None other but you. Hallelujah. So take up your sword. Take charge of your promise. Take charge of your promise. Hallelujah. Drive out the Philistines. Drive out everything contrary to the word of God. Hallelujah. Take up your sword and follow him. Take charge of your destiny. Hallelujah. Be conformed into his will. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. For his mystery, the mystery of his will has been revealed unto you. You are sons and daughters. Hallelujah. May the Lord richly bless you. Amen. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. You love the Lord this morning, this afternoon. Hallelujah. There is a change of ministry. There is a change of things happening. A change happening in your bodies. Change happening in your life. Hallelujah. He has given unto us all spiritual blessings in Christ Jesus. All that was in the Father, He's poured into the Son. All that was in the Son, He has poured into the church. All spiritual blessings. Amen. Take a hold of them. Hallelujah. Amen. All the He has opened up the top. Amen. Amen. And He has poured it all unto us. May the Lord richly bless you. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Oh, let's give him a hand of praise. Let's worship him. Let's give him glory. Give him honor. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you for your will, Lord. Thank you for the mystery of your will, Father. Amen. We are sons and daughters. Predestinated from before the foundation of the world, Father. Hallelujah. Amen. Nothing can stand before you, church. Hallelujah. No sin. No devil. Hallelujah. No sickness. Hallelujah. May the Lord richly bless you, church. Amen. Give him a hand of praise. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, I feel good this afternoon. Amen. May you take control of your destiny in church. Hallelujah. Tell him, Father, not thy my will, but thy will be done, Lord. Amen. Let him take control of your being. Let him take control of your being. Let him take control of everything. Hallelujah. He needs you. He's come down. Hallelujah. Looking down upon his church. Who may I use today? Say, use me, Father. Pick me up, Lord. I am ready, Father. I take a hold of me, Lord Jesus. Oh, blessed be the name of... May you turn around, greet your brother, greet your sister. May the Lord richly bless you. Amen, amen, amen. God bless you, Nairobi. Amen.